Hello, old Inu family, and may the Lord bless you and keep you safe. I want to say some things this afternoon. I want to bring some things about uh, in this video to let you know what Boat Inu has busy been doing. Boat Toshi, our leader, has been busy doing. But first of all, I want to say something. I'm not trying to be profound when I say this following. I say it because it's the truth. Honesty is not dead. Faith is not dead. Family is not dead. Community is not dead. Truth is not dead. Honor is not dead. Chivalry is not dead. Respect is not dead. Goodness and, and positivity, they're not dead. Dreams are not dead. Honest quests are not dead. Visions are not dead. All of these words are synonymous with Votinu. Now, you could take the word honor and you could say honor inu and it means the same thing as votinu. You could take the word truth and say truth inu and it means the exact same thing as vote inu. Our CEO has made at his point to be absolutely honest in everything that he does. He has never lied to us, not once. He has never tried to hurt anyone. And honestly, I think the truth of the matter is, I don't believe it's in him to try to hurt anyone. That's what I honestly believe. I don't think that it is. I'm gonna say that again, I'm gonna reiterate. He's never lied to us, not one time. If he says he's going to do it, he does it. If he says he's not going to do it, he doesn't do it. He's kept all of his promises. There are people who are trying to uh, uh, hurt our project. There's only... Three reasons I can think of anybody who would want to try to hurt the Volt Inu project. Either through ignorance, which comes from the fact, which is my second point, they've done no research, <clears throat> or they're jealous of how far our, our project has gone, <clears throat> how fast we've grown, uh, the promise has been, we have, do you know, we have 23 exchanges since uh, the coin has been released. 23 exchanges. There are, uh, are projects who have been around for a year or two, even years, who don't have near that many exchanges. Um, I'm going to give a list here of... Uh, uh, we have Vote Inu in uh, uh, Japanese. We have Vote Inu in Spanish. We have Vote Inu in Turkey. We have it in Dutch, Germany, India, Indonesia, Philippines, Vietnam, Korea, Japan, uh, Arabic, Iran, Russia. Uh, we have Brazil. Then, of course, we have our official website. Um, Vote Inu dot in. Uh, we have a, a telegram, but please pay attention when I ask you to do this. If you're going to um, go into our telegram, only go by going to our website, <clears throat> into our telegram. There are scammers out there that would try to rip you off with their little fake Vote Inu. <laughs> have you got your 20? percent reward yet or listen there are no rewards you can get from any of these scammers all they'll do is give you a link to a website asking for your seed phrase now <clears throat> nobody in vote inu nobody not me not anybody will ever ask you to go to any link requesting your seed phrase <clears throat> um, these rewards and 
No, look, uh, just go to our Telegram. Look, and if you have questions, ask, then ask questions. They'll be answered. There's no stupid question. There's The only stupid question is the unasked question. So under no circumstance, if somebody's asking you for your seed phrase and you have a question, go to our voice chat in our Telegram. Don't be afraid to go on there and talk to us. We're not going to bite you. <laughs> You're more than welcome there. Go to the Telegram and voice chat. Talk to us. Ask questions. This is very important. Uh, you're very important. You're special to us. Absolutely. Every uh, member of the Volt Army is very special to us. And now, let me behoove people, please. Don't be trashing other people's coins or projects. Let's not do that. That's not the heartbeat of, of Volt Inu. That's not the, the heartbeat of Volt Toshi. We don't subscribe to that. Uh, people have invested their hard-earned money into whatever program they're in. So uh, don't try your hardest to destroy a program or belittle it. The only reason a person would try to do that to uh, vote in you is because they've never done any research. I've told you two other reasons a minute ago. Now, I want to get into some stuff here in a minute. We have uh, uh, a Reddit official. We have a Reddit account on Reddit. Uh, we've gone through uh, a v V2 migration. We have our dashboard on our uh, our website. We have our roadmap there, our tokenomics, our white paper and audit. <laughs> our, we, we have our, 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 the amount that we burned. Now, we had uh, uh, Pablo Crow, a good man. Uh, man has worked. Uh, he has shed blood, sweat, and tears for... Uh, the Volt Army, ever since it was launched, uh, he just keeps on and keeps on. Uh, he deserve, He has his own uh, uh, YouTube. It was recently hacked. And so uh, he's got another one, uh, uh, Pablo Volts, V-O-L-T-Z, Crow. And as a matter of fact, here in the next hour or so, he's going to have a, an, an AMA. <clears throat> so... Go over there and give him some love. Um, might give him a super chat, whatever. Um, but just go in there and tell him how much he's appreciated. Uh, he has been in here since uh, day one of Voltinu. He's been making YouTube after YouTube, talking to people, doing interviews. Now, uh, this Benzinga interview. Now, I wasn't familiar with who Benzinga is. Uh, however, it seems to be the uh, highest ranking or one of the most high, highest ranking places that, that the people in uh, stock markets and, and uh, well, cryptocurrencies, uh, they go to this place in order to find out what is going on with either their stock marks they, they're thinking about investing in or cryptocurrency. And we captured their attention and they called the ambassador of uh, Vote Inu and as well as, uh, I think, um, <clears throat> oh, well, I know they had uh, Pablo on there for certain. I, I forget who the, there was two of them. Uh, anyway, um, uh, we have, uh, we're all now supported by BitKeep OS. Um, there's one in here, Defensa, uh, Y, Justica. Uh, we have the Elon Goat statue uh, coming up. We have, part, we have a lot of sponsorships. The Elon Goat statue, let me tell you, if you don't know about that, <clears throat> It's a, a, a rocket, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, no, it's a goat. That's why it's called Elon Goat. Well, duh. Anyway, it has Elon. It's a big statue with Elon's head on it. And it has Vote Inu dog that will be on it. And it, that is on it. And it will, will be presented to Elon Musk himself whenever it reaches Elon's 
um, home or whatever the destination where Elon is at. So we have that. Um, Elon is, I mean, Volt Inu is listed on Now Nodes. Uh, we have joined a partnership with the Undead Blocks. We have our own racer game. We have the Volt NFT Vault. Now, what that is, uh, Voltoshi uh, buys NFTs, and he's bought some uh, Shiba Inu NFTs. Uh, he, we have some um, Tesla stock. Those go into the vault. Um, now, what's the purpose behind these? Uh, I don't even know what all is in that vault, but there's a list of them if you want to look them up. I don't have that list. But um, the purpose of that, Voltoshi uh, uh, gathers these in the vault so that in the future when the prices go up and funds are needed to get us on more exchanges, do you realize some of these exchanges cost one and a half to two million dollars to get listed? That money doesn't just fall out of trees or doesn't fall out of the sky or grow on trees. It's got to come from somewhere. He very intelligently decided to find a way to do it. So he started investing in um, in different uh, things for us to uh, to have at our disposal. They can be liquidated, and these exchanges uh, can be added to our portfolio. We are now on uh, Crypto Cart. We are now on uh, Shopping.io. Now, what does this mean? This means that with Shopping.io, you can actually go there and you can spend your Volt Inu in, well, Walmart for one. I forget the other ones, but uh, yeah, look it up on uh, uh, Shopping.io. I'm not going to spend my <laughs> Volt Inu, but you might want to. That's up to you. <laughs> uh, we're on the Ethereum Dex Tools, Etherscan, Ethereum Liquidity, uh, BSC Dex Tools, BSC, BSC Scan, BSC Liquidity. Uh, we have uh, YouTube uh, Influencers, Pablo Crow, Richards Crypto, Cassidy, uh, DJ Legend, uh, Cox's Crypto, Space Chick Crypto, and of course, uh, mine that you're on now, Altcoin <coughs> Holder. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, oh, um, I want to get into this. Uh, hold on. Let me keep on going here. Um, well, we've got three artists who wrote songs <laughs> about Botinu. Um, uh, it's, it's pretty amazing. I want to go in through here. There's something I want to pull up. Um, where is it at? Come on, Ronald. Did I, did I say anything about uh, Park City? Uh, Farmer's Market in uh, Park City, Utah. Yeah, uh, we are a partnership with them. Uh, there's also a bakery out there that we're partnership with. And uh, if I'm not mistaken, it's the bakery. They've printed up some business cards. And uh, you take the business card, you get it from the bakery when you buy your products. You plant the entire business card. Within that business card, there are seeds. That That's genius. That's just amazing. The Park City Farmer's Market, <laughs> every bag that goes out of there has uh, the uh, uh, Vote Inu logo and the website. And uh, every item that's sold um, at the, the bakery, I forget where the bakery is located, um, uh, every item that's sold there has the Vote Inu logo. Uh, logo and website. Now, we also have a billboard overseas. We've got uh, digital billboards in Turkey. I forget how many there are there. Uh, we have so many places that we're reaching. There is a, uh, um, uh, what do they call it? Canteen truck. truck. It's a vegetarian Mexican canteen truck. I think at Los Angeles, I believe it is. <laughs> that we are uh, sponsoring. And uh, on everything that's sold out of that truck, um, our Dodge, um, our Vote Inu logo is on it. 
And so we've got so many things that uh, some I, I even, someone's not even listed on here. It's just absolutely amazing um, the things that are that Botoshi has done. Now I'm going to list the uh, the news media news that has mentioned us and talked about us. Digital Journal, March the 30th, 2022. Bloomberg, March the 30th, 2022. Uh, Monaco Forbes, March the 29th, 2022. India Forbes, March the 11th, 2022. Tech Times, March the 9th, 2022. Entrepreneur, March the 8th, 2022. Benzinga, February, February the 23rd, 2022. Crypto Adventure, February the 9th, 2022. Coin Telegraph, February the 7th, 2022. NASDAQ, January the 18th, 2022. Bloomberg, January the 18th, 2022. Investing.com, January the 10th, 2022. Daily Coin, January 10th. 2022. Cryptila, January the 7th, 2022. Yahoo Finance, December 24th, Christmas Eve, 2021. <laughs> what? Really? Wow. That's, uh, that's absolutely amazing. Um, it really is. That all that, all those media outlets uh, took time to write uh, about the attributes, and they have high praise to say in these articles. I'm not going to take the time to read them all on here, but they have high praise to say about uh, Voltinu. Now, <clears throat> Why am I excited about this coin? Well, we have so many partnerships and so many uh, sponsorships going on and so many, uh, so much media that's, that is uh, interested in what we are and what we're doing. We're highly decentralized. Uh, that means that we, we have, we, we're having massive burns. Our coin, the limit of our coins are, is constantly going down. Therefore, the price constantly goes up. I'm going to tell you now that list of things that Vote Inu is, it's the safe place for you to be in the crypto world. Now, you know as well as I do, you get out there and you try to, if you go on to dextools.io, go over there, look at the, uh, oh, the new, the new coins that's been released. I have. Now there's a, a tool you need to be using on every coin. It's called uh, tokensniffer.com. Now, if you go on Dex Tools and uh, you pull up uh, a, a coin that you're interested in, and it will have an icon below the price on the left hand side, and it will be either EtherScan or BSN Scan according to the coin. And uh, let's say it's EtherScan. You click on the Etherscan icon, and in that page, you'll find on the right-hand side, about halfway down, the contract address. You go to the far end of the contract. You uh, there, there'll be two little notebooks. Uh, one will be here, and one will be like overlapping the other. Uh, click on that. That copies the address that you're looking at. Now, take it over to Token. Um, sniffer.com and you're going to see a search bar at the top of tokensniffer.com 
paste the address in there. And there'll be a drop down uh, telling you the name of the, of the address you just put in there. Click on it. And they're probably going to ask you if you're a robot. Click no. Just click in the box. And you're not a robot. Unless you are. I don't know. Anyway. Um, anyway. Uh, you take a look at that. Uh, it'll open up and show you the good, bad, and the ugly about the coin you're looking at. Now, at the top right-hand side, it'll say um, uh, it either is or isn't a honeypot. If it's got a, a red check, then uh, that means it's not either good, it's a honeypot. Uh, a black X means, as far as that line, it looks like it's not a honeypot. And you, you there, now there are there's more than one way to have a honeypot. <laughs> You can have a contract that allows for um, uh, the taxes of a coin to be raised to 99% so that it's impossible to sell. It'll still sniff out that it's not a honeypot. However, if somewhere along the life of this coin, there's an open contract that's not been locked that allows the uh, uh, the creator of the coin to adjust the amount of taxes you pay when you sell the coin, he can raise that to 99% and you can't sell it now. There's more than one way to have a honeypot. <laughs> you can scroll all the way down to the bottom and there, you might find that it says that the owner wallet uh, owns, I've seen it, it's, I've seen it where it says the owner wallet holds 100% of the liquidity. Ooh, get out of there. Man, it's an absolute honeypot. In other words, a honeypot means you, you can buy all you want, but you cannot sell it. There's more than one way to have a honeypot. And then let's say everything is looks off. There's no red marks there. You know, uh, everything's checked off. Black looks beautiful. Now, at the top, it says, there may be hidden code, malicious code that we haven't found. So you have to be very, very careful. And my point is this, it's horrible out there. I went to Dex Tools and started searching out these new coins that were being dropped. I would say 99%, and I'm not kidding. I'm not, I'm not stretching the truth because I might have found one or two I think one in two days searching that didn't sniff out as a honeypot. Oh my lands. And if you don't know how to do your research, well, you'll get all excited. There's a brand new coin, got 17 zeros. Whoo, I'm gonna buy into that. Mm-hmm. And uh now there's a way to make money on that. You can, if you're blessed with some good fortune, you can buy into it. When it goes to 20000 sell it, watch it and see what it does. You know, you've made some money, but please don't do that. Go buy you some Volt Inu. It's safe harbor, okay? We don't want to steal from you. We don't want to rug pull you, honestly. <laughs> now, I started making these YouTubes. I'm convinced because I've watched Voltoshi. Everything he's promised, he's done. He's never lied, never broke a promise. Do you know of any other uh, project out there in the crypto world that can say the same thing? You'll have these uh, uh, people who own these coins and own, they'll make a promise and then, oh, there's this reason here. I can't keep it right now. It's been a delay in my lands. Three months, four months, six months, you got nothing but excuse after excuse after excuse. Oh my goodness. But if I think if Botoshi feels like there might be some kind of delays, he won't even say anything. He waits until he's got all of his ducks in a row. And uh, he's even surprised us with releasing things that he didn't even tell us about. They were wonderful. An exchange or something. So rather than, than, uh, uh, tell something that turns out to not be true or it's going to take time. He just won't tell anybody about it until he gets it all straightened out. But I'm going to tell you right now, 
if you go ahead and go and devote Inu and uh, buy yourself some coins, let's say you've got uh, 30 million vote Inu. <laughs> when it reaches a penny, and it will, it's inevitable, it's eventually going to reach a penny. When it reaches a penny, if you own a million coins, each million coins you own that are valued at a penny is worth $10,000 to you. So if you've got 30 million coins at 10,000, that's $300,000. What did you pay for that? $30, $40? Hmm. And we're going to go to a penny and we're going to go to a dollar. If you can hold your coins, then that, guess what? That 30 million coins will go to $30 million. I'm not exaggerating. I'm really not. Uh, look at the coins that have done that. Um, absolutely. There are coins right now that are $2,000, $3,000 a piece, uh, $5, $6, $3, $10. Uh, we have uh, the leader at the helm of this big ship that we're on. It's a rocket ship, but it also flows on water because Voltoshi keeps talking about seas and lakes. So it is an a amphibious <laughs> rocket ship. And we have uh, our commander-in-chief at the helm, Voltoshi. We are the Volt Army. We are the Volt family. Um, we want to uh, unite the other honest, honorable cryptocurrencies. Uh, this project is an honorable project. Votoshi is an honorable man. Um, uh, uh, Pablo, Pablo Crow uh, gives you his YouTube because, in an honorable way because he's honorable. Crypto check, she's honorable. These people that I listed earlier that have all these uh, YouTubes, uh, we are all honorable people. We have no intention of taking anything. I'd rather give something to you than take it away from you. So I guess I've covered this as much as I intend to. I know I've got a, a lot on here. So um, I'm going to go. Um, before I go, I do want to pray. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we love you, we praise, and we worship you. Uh, thank you for the, uh, well, thank you for Voltoshi, for Voltinu, for the family that you blessed us, blessed me with, blessed us with. We pray you will be done in that. And we, I still continue praying for the people who, well, the families who have suffered so much through the, uh, the Luna crash um, for everybody out there as they try to find work and as they try to pay their rent and pay their groceries I pray we all pray that you will be done in them and it, we all bind together in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and we all prayed and said amen all right this is altcoin holder did I introduce myself I don't think so anyway this is Altcoin Holder. I'm signing off until I make another one and see you again. God bless. Have a good day.